Do we condone the widening exploitation of animals? Or do we act to end it? The people here who have masks on are people who uh, either aren't known to the police or who, whose activities aren't known to the police. Um, whereas with myself, I've already been to prison twice for uh, animal liberation front activities. Each of us spent a year in prison. And then in the spring of 1976, the Animal Liberation Front was formed. And that rapidly grew to be a much larger organisation and uh, now has several hundred members. Since 1977, there have been more than 400 animal liberation raids in Britain and many in the USA, Canada, Holland and France. We'd feel it perfectly OK for someone to have broken into a concentration camp to free people or to have damaged the torture equipment used by the Nazis. And, you know, we see uh, the torture and imprisonment of animals in the same light. And I think if you look at it like that, um, it would seem probably that our activities are much too lenient rather than being extreme in any way. Front. Early this morning, one of our groups was in action in the southwest of England. The target was a factory farm, Sunnyside Poultry Limited. Here, many thousands of chickens are forced to live in very small wire cages. More than 100 birds were rescued, 